chapter 11 simple interest learning objectives by the end of this lesson students will be able to know and use simple interest terminology understand when interest is paid and when it is earned know and use the formula for calculating simple interest warm up mrs johnson deposit rupees 50000 in her bank account on 23rd october 21 she took out the money after a year and she got rupees 58000 calculate the difference teachers note apprise the student that the extra amount which mrs johnson got is the interest whenever we deposit money in the bank for safety banks use it to give loans to other people the bank then pays us a sum of money as interest as compensation for having used our money boy deposit rupees thousand he withdraw rupees thousand extra money zero this means that when you deposit money in a piggy bank, you will get no extra money. Boy deposit 1000 rupees, he withdraws 1100, extra money 100. Now, when you deposit money in a bank, you will get extra money. The extra money that you get from the bank is known as interest or simple interest denoted by SI. The money that you deposit in the bank is known as principal denoted by P. The number of years for which you deposit this money is known as time denoted by T. The SI is calculated at a rate percent decided by the bank every year denoted by R percent P A per year or per annum. SI equals to P into R into T upon 100. The money which you get from the bank including the interest is known as amount denoted by A. Amount equals to principal plus interest or A equals to P plus I. Solved example. Example 1. Find the simple interest in amount if P equals to rupees 4000, R equals to rupees 5% PA, T equals to 2 years. Solution. S equals to P into R into T upon 100 equals to 4000 into 5 into 2 upon 100 equals to rupees 400. Amount equals to P plus SI equals to 4000 plus 400 equals to rupees 4400. Example 2. Mr. Anubhav deposit rupees 5000 in the bank for 5 years at the rate of 6% PA, but amount he will get back after 5 years. Solution. P equals to rupees 5000, R equals to rupees 6% PA, T equals to 5 years, SI equals to P into R into T upon 100 equals to 5000 plus 6 plus 5 upon 100 equals to 1500, A equals to P plus SI equals to rupees equals to 5000 plus 1500 is equals to rupees 6500. Hence, Mr. Hanubhav will get rupees 6500 after 5 years. Facts to know. The official discovery of the interest was found in the 16th century by Jacob Bernoulli. Example 3. Anush deposit Rs. 3500 in a bank and got back an amount of Rs. 4000 after one year. Find the simple interest that Anuj get. Solution P equals to Rs. 3500. R equals to Rs. 4000. SI equals to A minus P equals to rupees 4000 minus 3500 is equals to rupees 500. Hence, Anuj got an interest of rupees 500. Example 4. Rudit deposit rupees 5000 in IDBI bank for rupees 3 years, which earns him an interest of 8%. What is the amount he gets back after 1 year, 2 years, and 3 years? Solution. For every rupees 100, Rudit gets rupees 8. The rate is 8% for every 100. For rupee 1 he gets equals to rupees 8 upon 100. For rupees 5000 he gets 5000 into 8 upon 100 equals to 400. Simple interest for 1 year equals to 400. Simple interest for 2 years equals to rupees 400 into 2 equals to 800 rupees. Simple interest for 3 years equals to 400 rupees into 3 equals to rupees 1200. Amount after one year equals to P plus SI. 5000 rupees plus 400 equals to rupees 5400. Amount after two years equals to P plus SI is equals to rupees 5000 plus 800 equals to rupees 5800. Amount after three years P plus SI is equals to rupees 5000 plus 1200 equals to rupees 6200. Example 5. 
रिया इन्वेस्टेड सर्टेन अमाउंट ऑफ मनी एंड गॉड बैक एन अमाउंट ऑफ रुपीज फोर्टी एट हंड्रेड इफ द बैंक पेड एन इंटरेस्ट ऑफ रुपीज फोर हंड्रेड फाइन द अमाउंट रिया इन्वेस्टेड सोल्यूशन ए इक्वल्स टू रुपीज फोर्टी एट हंड्रेड एस आई इक्वल्स टू रुपीज फोर हंड्रेड पी इक्वल्स टू ए माइनस एस आई इज इक्वल्स टू रुपीज फोर्टी एट हंड्रेड माइनस रुपीज फोर हंड्रेड इज इक्वल्स टू रुपीज फोर्टी फोर हंड्रेड रिया इन्वेस्टेड रुपीज फोर्टी फोर हंड्रेड एक्सरसाइज इलेवन पॉइंट वन क्वेश्चन वन फाइन द सिंपल इंटरेस्ट एन अमाउंट एफ ए पी इक्वल्स टू रुपीज टू थाउजेंड आर इक्वल्स टू एट परसेंट टी इक्वल्स टू थ्री ईयर्स आंसर अमाउंट टू थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एटी एंड इंटरेस्ट फॉर एटी बी पी इक्वल्स टू रुपीज सिक्स थाउजेंड आर इक्वल्स टू टेन परसेंट टी इक्वल्स टू सिक्स ईयर्स आंसर अमाउंट नाइन थाउजेंड सिक्स ईयर एंड इंटरेस्ट थ्री थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड सी पी इक्वल्स टू फिफ्टीन हंड्रेड रुपीज आर इक्वल्स टू टू परसेंट टी इक्वल्स टू वन ईयर आंसर अमाउंट वन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड थर्टी इंटरेस्ट थर्टी डी P equals to rupees eight thousand. R equals to seven percent. T equals to two years. Answer amount nine thousand one hundred twenty. Interest one thousand one hundred twenty. Question two. Ruchi deposits rupees eighty five hundred in the bank at the rate of five percent PA for six years. How much money did she get back after six years? Answer eleven thousand fifty. Question three. John deposit rupees five thousand five hundred in the bank at the rate of eight point five percent PA for ten years. Find the amount John got after ten years. Answer ten thousand one hundred seventy five. Question four. Sona deposits rupees three thousand two hundred and got back rupees three thousand six hundred after two years. Find the interest she got. Answer four hundred. Question five. Vijay deposited a certain amount of money in the bank. He got back rupees nine thousand nine hundred. If the bank paid him nine hundred as an interest, then what amount did Vijay deposit in the bank? Answer nine thousand. Question six. Ritesh deposited two thousand rupees in Yes Bank for four years, which earns him an interest of rupees eight percent. What is the amount he gets after one year, two year, three year, four year, and five years? Answer first year. Twenty thousand one hundred sixty. Second year, twenty thousand three hundred twenty. Third year, twenty thousand four hundred eighty. Fourth year, twenty thousand six hundred forty. Fifth year, twenty thousand nine hundred. Question seven. Kiran invested a certain amount of money and got back an amount of rupees seven thousand two hundred. If the bank paid an interest of rupees seven hundred, find the amount that Kiran invested. Answer six thousand five hundred. Question eight. Pinky deposits of rupees forty five hundred and got back an amount of rupees five thousand after a year. Find the simple interest she got. Answer five hundred. Question six. Pratika deposits rupees eight thousand for four years at a rate of six percent PA. Find the amount she got. Answer nine thousand nine hundred twenty. Question ten. Raghav deposited rupees four thousand eight hundred and got back an amount of rupees five thousand five hundred after two years. Find the simple interest he got. Answer seven hundred. To find principal P when I R and T are given. P equals two hundred into I upon R into T. To find rate R when I P and T are given. R is equals to hundred into I upon P into T. To find time is equals to when I P and R are given. T equals to hundred into I upon P into R. Solve the example. Example one. Find P if I equals to rupees eight hundred. R equals to five percent. P A T equals to two years. Solution. P equals to hundred into I upon R into T equals to hundred into eight hundred upon five into two is equals to rupees eight thousand. Example two: Find R if I is equals to rupees fifteen hundred, P is equals to rupees five thousand, T is equals to six hours. Solution: R equals to hundred into I upon P into T is equals to hundred into fifteen hundred upon five thousand into six is equals to five percent P A. Example three: Find T if I is equals to rupees twelve hundred, P is equals to rupees seventy five hundred, R is equals to eight percent P A. Solution: T equals to hundred into I upon P into R equals to hundred into twelve hundred upon seventy five hundred into eight equals to twelve years. 
Example 4. Agri a borrower does obtain sum of money at the rate of 5% PA for years. If she got rupees 250 as in trust, find the sum borrowed by her. Solution R is equal to 5%, T is equal to 4 years, R equals to rupees 250P, P is equal to 100 into I upon R into T. 100 into 250 upon 5 into 4 is equals to rupees 1250. Example 5. Sneha left rupees 4000 for 5 years. If she got an interest of rupees 800, find the rate of interest per annum at which she lend the money. Solution P 4000 rupees T 5 years I rupees 800 R R is equals to 100 into I upon P into T. 100 into 800 upon 4000 into 5 is equals to 4 percent. Example 6. Shivam invested rupees 10,000 at the rate of 3% PA and got an interest of rupees 600 at the end of some year. Find the time after which Shivam got back rupees 10,600. Solution P equals to rupees 10,000, R is equals to 3%, I is equals to rupees 600, T is equals to T is equals to 100 into I upon P into R is equals to 100 into 600 upon 10,000 into 3 is equals to 2 years. Exercise 11.2 Question 1. Find P if A I is equals to 500 rupees, R is equals to 2% P A, T is equals to 2 years. Answer 12,500 B. I is equals to rupees 660, R is equals to rupees 4 percent, P A T is equals to 3 years. Answer 5005 5 years. Question 2. Find R if A, I is equals to rupees 700, P is equals to rupees 2500, T is equals to 1 year. Answer 28 percent, B, I is equals to rupees 1000, P is equals to rupees 6500, T is equals to 5 years. Answer 31 percent. Question 3. Find T if A. I is equals to rupees 200, P is equals to rupees 2000, R is equals to 5 years per annum. Answer 2 years. B. I is equals to rupees 6000, P is equals to rupees 24000, R is equals to 5%, P A. Answer 5 years. Question 4. Sona invested rupees 2000 for 2 years. She got an interest of rupees 200. Find the rate of interest per annum at which she invested the money. Answer 5%. Question 5. Kalpi lent a certain sum of money at the rate of 8% PA for 3 years. If she got rupees 600 as interest, find the sum borrowed by Kalpi. Answer 2500. Question 6. Pakhi invested rupees 4500 at the rate of 4% PA. She got an interest of rupees 900 at the end of some year. Find the time after which she got back rupees 5400. Answer 5 years. Quick tip 1. If time t is given in month, then divide it by 12 to convert into years. 2. If time t is given in days, then divide it by 365 to convert into years. Solved example. Example 1. Mini deposited rupees 2500 at the rate of 6% per annum for 7 years, 4 months. Find the amount she got back. Solution. P is equals to rupees 2500. R is equals to rupees 6% per annum. T is equals to 7 years and 4 months. Is equals to 7. 4 upon 12 years. Is equals to 7. 1 upon 3 years. Is equals to 22 upon 3 years. SI. P into R into T upon 100 equals to 2500 into 6 into 22 upon 100 into 3 is equals to rupees 1100. A is equals to P plus SI is equals to rupees 2500 plus 1100 is equals to rupees 3600. Mini got back rupees 3600. Example 2. Kamal borrowed rupees 4000 at the rate of 5% PA for 220 days. Find the interest and amount paid by Kamal. Solution P is equals to rupees 4000. R is equals to rupees 5% PA. T is equals to 220 days is equals to 220 upon 365 years. SI is equals to P into R into T upon 100. 4000 into 5 into 220 upon 100 into 365 is equals to rupees 120.55.
A is equals to P plus S I. Rupees 4000 plus 120.55 is equals to 4124.55 rupees. Amount paid by Komal is rupees 4120.55 and interest paid by Komal is rupees 120.55. Exercise 11.3 Question 1 Raj borrowed Rs. 1500 at the rate of 6% PA for 7 years and 3 months. Find the amount he has to pay. Answer 2152.20 Question 2 Sajal invested Rs. 3400 at the rate of 8% PA for 225 days. Find the interest and amount he got back. Answer 3567.67 Question 3. Sonal deposited Rs. 1400 at the rate of 6% PA for 8 years and 5 months. Find the amount she got back after 8 years and 5 months. Answer 2107. Question 4. Anubhav borrowed Rs. 14,600 at the rate of 14% PA for 175 days. Find the amount he paid back. Answer 15,580. Formula 1. SI is equals to P into R into T upon 100. 2. A is equals to I plus P. 3. P is equals to A minus I. 4. I is equals to A minus P. 5. R is equals to 100 into I upon P into T. 6. T is equals to 100 into I upon P into R. 6. P is equals to 100 into I upon R into T. Think wisely. Two money lenders lend money on the following condition. Ram rupees 18,000 at the rate of 6%. Raj rupees 24,000 at the rate of 3%. At the end of one year, who will get more interest and by how much? Answer Raj. Mental math. Fill in the blanks. 1. Write the formula of simple interest. 2. The money that we deposit in a bank is known as principal. 3. The extra money that you get from the bank is known as interest. 4. Principal is denoted by P. 5. Time in is denoted by T. 6. The number of years for which you deposit the money is known as time. Maths lab activity materials required. Paper, pen, application form. Steps 1. Student will need to choose 3 out of the 6 vehicles that they are interested in purchasing. 2. Students will calculate the interest and balance for the three vehicles from two bank offers. The teacher will give the amount and interest for each vehicle. 3. After completing all calculations, students will determine which car they want to purchase. In addition, they will determine which bank will give them the best offer. 4. Students will fill out the car loan application. Make sure they use a fake address and phone number. 5. The teacher will either approve or deny their loan application based on the calculated monthly payments. If incorrect, it will be denied and the students will need to fix it.